What's up, keto people? So before I get into this morning, which I'm thinking I'm probably gonna do a weigh-in every morning or every other morning. Um, I know they say don't do that or whatever, but I am always curious. So just depending upon what my schedule is and all that kind of stuff, I'll probably, I'll try to do it. Um, but anyway, here's what happened last night. Not Nothing too much, but a craving did hit. Hey guys, so it is around 7 p.m. And um, of the first day, which, so now I should really record the full day and just bring it to you the next morning, um, I think. Um, I'm getting a little bit of the cravings. Man, actually, when I went into the freezer, um, I will show you a picture um, of these coconut milk chocolate ice cream things that one of my Facebook keto group had showed me and I really don't think there's anything bad in there um, but you know staying away from sweets for a few weeks and so I've had those in there for a while now and I just looked at them and I was like oh my gosh but I'm um, gonna be good for a while so um, I just said nope to those so I've been perfectly fine but I will say that I have had some cravings and for sure whenever I saw that my sweet tooth was like oh but not caving in see you tomorrow okay and now I'll show you what I went through uh, this afternoon well early in the morning and this afternoon but I will tell you that I did step on the scale and this is what I saw so nice little um, drop there I think 3.6 pounds or something but you know that's water weight I'm not jumping up for joy about it I'm, I expect that um, especially for the first day. Um, I actually even think um, the second day, if I don't have it the first day, then I get it the second day, that sort of you know few poundage thing. So whenever I get that, then it kind of starts to, to waver off a little bit. So I don't expect too much of a significant big drop after that. But anyway, we'll see where it goes. So let's get on to um, this morning. Quick note, it is 10:30 in the morning and I'm gonna be honest with you I'm not really that hungry which leads me kind of curious about if there's no way I'd still be fat adapted I don't know I that was a long time of being kicked out of ketosis so I just don't imagine that I would bounce back like that but I'm not really hungry so I don't think I'm gonna eat anything right now and I have a nail appointment because of this um, and I have to go see my family for a little bit. Not have to. I'm just going over there for a little bit. So I think I'm going to be fine until dinner. So, and then last night was pretty good. So we'll see. Oh my gosh, y'all. I passed by Starbucks. You know, my caramel frappuccino stuff. But I didn't get it or anything. But that does give me like sweet. Oh, I want sweet. So I went ahead and I got some broccoli. And I'm getting some heavy heavy cream um, to make broccoli. And Alfredo over at my parents' house. Okay, got my nail done. Um, I will say that, okay, I'm joking about the Starbucks thing. I really never get tempted, but I will say the smell of it is just like, oh my gosh, um, because it just reminds me of my caramel frappuccino. But um, other than that, I would never, ever do it. Um, I'm not really tempted at all, but I'm parked close to a Baskin Robbins. Oh my God. Now that's funny. But anyway, going to my folks. Okay, I'm at my parents' house, so I made broccoli and alfredo sauce and then I'll be back for meal two okay so I am back home and I will tell you that alfredo sauce which I have that video on if you want to check it out it's the best Albert alfredo sauce I mean I loved Olive Garden's alfredo but you know they have flour in that so um, this is so much better than than Olive Garden so much better 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 um, so, but but it was really good and it filled me. I'm not completely um, hungry right now, but I do have friends that are coming over tonight. Um, we usually play games and drink, so not heavily, but I'm gonna have to pass on the booze, like I said, for, you know, I'm gonna give it try for three weeks, but possibly only gonna be two, but you know, can't do that. So, um, Anyway, this is what my final meal is. It's a smaller, you know, still my bacon wrap things because I made um, a few of them yesterday for, for extra and some more of my cauliflower mac and cheese. Nothing too ridiculous. Anyway, that's all I have. I will see you tomorrow.